My friend Earl Davis was one of the friendliest people I've ever met. He told me this story. He was driving through Los Angeles and he and his wife, Jean, got lost. They wandered around for a bit and then they wandered into an extremely difficult part of the city. Earl pulled over, rolled down the window, got out a map, this is before GPS, and he was looking at the map trying to figure out where to go when a young man came up next to the window with a gun, pointed at Earl and said, give me your money. Earl did this, friend, we're lost. We're trying to get here and we're not quite sure where we are. Well, the young man looked at him, looked at the map, and then he did this. Well, here's what you do. You gotta get over here, then you head over, go to the light, turn left, and once you get there, you'll know you're good to go. Earl said, thank you, and he sped off. Now, here's the thing about Earl, and by the way, I'm not recommending you do that every time in that situation. But when Earl said friend, he meant it. It wasn't dependent on what the other person was doing. What kind of friends do you have in your life? When it comes to interpersonal relationships, enjoy the journey.